Hi, this is Pastor Bob, and welcome to Pastor Bob Daily, and welcome to my home. If you could design God any way you wanted Him, how would you design Him? That's a good question, isn't it? How would you design Him? Would you design Him with more or less love? Would you design Him with more or less grace? Would you design Him with more or less legalism? How about rules and regulations? Would you design him with more rules or less rules? How about relationships? Would you design him to be more personal or more or further away, not so much involved in your life? And how about being in touch? Do you want him to react and interact instantly, doing everything you tell him to do? Or do you want him to be a little slower? so things can kind of work themselves out and you can gain some wisdom as a respect as a as a result now how would you design him you know folks when we talk about god we talk about our feelings about him how we think he should be and so many times i have people say i believe in a god that and they explain him They explain him according to how they think he should be. And that's why doctrine is so different for us, difficult for us. Because we kind of design God according to our doctrine, according to the way we feel he ought to be, (laughs) and not necessarily the way that he is. And I'm really glad for that. Because my love is limited. I'd rather God's love wasn't. You know, I don't always offer grace to everybody, even to myself. But I sure appreciate it when God offers it to me. I don't always pray the right things. And I'm really glad that God doesn't answer like that sometimes. Because, oh man, some of the prayers that I've prayed would have gotten me into some really big problems. You hear what I'm saying? Folks, it's so much more important that we get to know God for who he is than what we think he should be. And we don't have a designer God. (laughs) We have a God who has designed us. And we really have the opportunity, as we open up the Bible, to find out who he is, to find out how he operates, to find out exactly how we act and interact with him. But one thing that I appreciate about God the most is his love for me, for you. And that it's unlimited. We've been talking about that all week. And that I couldn't have designed that. And honestly, I didn't know I really needed that until I did. And I hope that you'll think about your relationship with God today. Do you have a designer God? Or are you honestly in relationship with a God who is realistic, who is who he says and does what he does? Something to think about. God bless you. Have a great day.